For 11 days in mid-October, the State Fair occupies center stage, attracting upwards of a million people. The fair also requires constant oversight by the Department of Agriculture. A tip to the State Auditor's Waste and Abuse Hotline resulted in this report, which says Agriculture Commissioner Steve Troxler and his top two lieutenants spent more than $22,000 on hotel stays. In the eyes of the state, that's a violation of budget regulations. The message it sends to his staff, I can break these rules and I can say I'm justified. The audit says the department paid for their hotels, meals and other expenses, even though the department's main office in downtown Raleigh is their designated duty station. Nobody's questioning why they stayed overnight in a hotel in Raleigh. State budget rules restrict overnight travel destinations to at least 35 miles from home unless a waiver is obtained. It said the department management ignored existing policy and did not seek a waiver from the overnight travel requirements. There are quite a few policies, there are quite a few rules and quite a few laws that I don't care for. Do I just all of a sudden start ignoring them? The audit also said costs for hotel rooms used during the fair exceeded the allowable state rate. There is a per diem, $71 a night. Um, the Renaissance is $200 a night. For all practical purposes, the commissioner and his chief of staff should have eaten the difference. I asked for an interview with the commissioner and was told he was unavailable, but he did send me a statement saying, Having these staff members close to the grounds is warranted, and the cost of hotel rooms for the commissioner, chief of staff, and fair manager is considered a necessary business expense for the fair's operation.